What up, my Capricorn babies? What it do, what it do, what it do? It's your favorite. The one and only extra love coming through to see what's popping with you. What up, my better half? What it do, though? Right, my baby, I heard you. I heard you, right? Because, see... I was just going to be smooth, right, my baby? Because, you know, we free spirits out here. And I was just going to holler at you on the first, right, my baby? But <clears throat> I I had to uh, come up with this segment that we about to dive into, right, my baby? And it's called The Unknown, right? Because I see a lot of people around you are anxious, right, my baby? And so that's kind of making you feel all wowsy woo-woo and not like yourself. So, <clears throat> how about this, right? 2021, we're really effective now, right, my baby? I'm not going to be like sugarcoat shit. You know what I'm saying? Time out for that, right, my baby? And I'm just going to give it to you rugged and raw. And either you can deal with the reality that I'm dropping on you, which I know you can. You know what I'm saying? And, you know what I'm saying? It'll prompt you to dive a little deeper, right, my baby? Because, see... I, f I fucks with you, Cap Cappy. You know, you, I always, from day one, called you the better half. Because you really be up on it, don't you, my baby? And I see right now you're at the pinnacle of your success. And I got several message, messages for you, right? You know, this is going to be a triggering video. I can already feel it, my baby. So if you're sensitive to the truth... And, you know what I'm saying, you want a baby spoon, tablespoon, really a teaspoon. I don't think this video can get. But since we tight and white and all right around here, going with the flow of love with, for, and to the highest love of all, unconditional love, the most high, your most high inside of you. Right, my baby? I know it shouldn't, shan't be no problem. Because, see, the first message out here is <clears throat> be open to receiving help, my baby. Be open to receiving help. Because openness helps you, right? That's going to be a key message for you. And also, endings to beginnings, right? Because while we was sh I was shuffling all of these, it was the Ten of Swords that popped out and the Ace of Cups. So, into mental imprisonment, the illusions, the bullshit, to, you know, new love, emotionally healed. Started from the bottom, now we're here, right? Another message that's going to be relevant for you, my better halves. Is hungry, not thirsty. See, it's a difference. You know what I'm saying? It's a difference between being hungry and thirsty. Everybody may be hungry, but some people, we call them straws. Because they be thirsty, my baby. Right? But the hungry ones, you know, are your brothers and your sisters. Right? The thirsty ones... Um, are not with the light. We're going to put it to like that. Because you're about, you are receiving love and happiness, right, my baby? And you're definitely going to get recognition for the hard work that you have done. Off another, the third card that popped out was this Joker. And you know I use everything, you know what I'm saying, to divine, to divine. Right, because when DNA talk, people listen. 
But off rip, this is you, Cap Capricorn. You're letting me know out the gate that you're in the fifth dimension. <laughs> All right, you tripping me out. You out here. <laughs> this is divine feminine energy. Uh, tower 16, which is why I'm going to finish up these for this. Seven family members, I owe them a video. And we're all going to be number 16. We're going to have 16 videos. And I think it's like 43 general reads, you know, different little things. And I always look at the playlist, you know, on this channel. But you're definitely in the fifth dimension working with Divine Feminine. Definitely. You're definitely in your Lilla pentagram fifth dimension all day long. That's what this card means. You know what I'm saying? It's no other way to interpret it. So, what's also going to be, what I'm hearing is, there are some that talk about you, but they don't follow through. Right, my baby? That's the message too. And I'm hearing from deja vu to popo vu. Deja vu to popo vu is going to be relevant. See, because I just still feel like this is a collective message, but they told me Capricorn, right? I was told Capricorn. See, that hot topic for you, my baby, is black rains. For the next three days and nights, this is being the first day, right? It's going to rain bodies. That's what I'm hearing. Right? And it's going to be an ending of a system and the beginning of a, another. So what's going to be significant is 180 degrees west. And if you know what west is, you know what that means. But I see this is prime time. Uh, you know, prime time. Something about the prime meridian, Greenwich um, time, London, England, and something about humidity right so dig this here uh in the next three days and nights it'll be a changing of the guard from the old patriarchal um type of energy to the divine feminine is how i have heard it black rain to black rain that is the message right Definitely um, wands out here. This is definitely spiritual. So anything that's dense and hot and can't fly high. Um, I guess I keep hearing getting mangled. Animals mangled. Next three days and nights black rain. That's how I heard it. 180 degrees west. And I'm taking that as... Um, divine feminine is being restored to her rightful place all day long. That, that was like, you know what I'm saying? The um, message and something about law. Something about law. Um, like you basically um, are divine feminine. But for my family, you're going to be calling the shots. Shots. It's going to go in your favor. Any type of um, um, ruling or decision or whatever is, is going to be in your favor. I think that was the messages for so far. But definitely from deja vu to popo vu. And that's for my deep divers. And openness helps you. Right? The overall message, I don't know what this means. It has something to do with brown skin, with melanin. You know. Let me just. Something about someone using and abusing brown like melanin. Using and abusing melanin. Using and abusing their spiritual gifts. I hear during the week, people need to uh, be on their ding. 
in the midst of the mist. <laughs> you, should, you should want to, but you definitely need to be on your day. And it's Something about, like I said, you know your enemies look just like you. And it's um, a lot of relationships that are patriarchal. And it's been revealed to you. Something about... Tapping in, especially during this week. I just keep hearing, come on, sis. Come on, bro. Be for real. You knew that when you um, weren't, you're not supposed to be in no relationship with anybody that dogs you. It's not going to work. It was the changing of the guard. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, something about... It's like a lot of Pisces energy, my baby. Jupiter. Jupiter rules water. That's ex that's expansion, right? Jupiter expansion globally. Definitely tapped into your cosmic and galactic family, and if you never have, this is. During the week, it's the week that you need to and you should want to. <laughs> right. That's what's up. Let me see. This is Craig. I just keep hearing about that black rain. And then, you know, what was so crazy because when I was getting the messages, I started hearing the rain outside, hitting the awning. So I was like, wow, it made me look. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Then I peeped up. Craig. Right, right, right. Yeah, something about a visitor. Why you out and about? I was told to remind you that you're just a visitor. You know what I'm saying? In this material realm, don't get too comfortable here. You know what I'm saying? It's a reminder. And I see you reminded people to tap in to their spirituality. And you be out and about in these spiritual streets, right, my baby? And like I said, it's uh, right now the number off rip that I got, besides the 180 and the 360, is 4444. This is like double double Scorpio. For show sure, somebody moon is Scorpio. For show. Sure. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yep, you having a spiritual epiphany, transformation, transfiguration. Yeah. A daya, higher learning. Did you hear? <laughs> you know what a visitor really means? Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I hear you're the best. Others, not so much. All right, my baby. I see you're tapped all the way in, my baby. I hear you a walkie-talkie. <laughs> right, 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 right. Walkie-talkie, yes. Because you walk it like you talk it. Maybe that'll be... That's your new nickname. <laughs> walkie talkie. Because you walk it like you talk it. And you definitely on your CB radio, ain't you, my baby? Definitely tap in. Yes. See, you're gay. <laughs> you're gay. You're spiritually happy and fulfilled and light and bright and everything's rainbow. But is somebody... And I want to say Pisces, somebody that you were high placement of Pisces, right? 
that they are really gay that you slept with. See, you're gay, happy, like la la la. You know what I'm saying? Spiritually fulfilled. You know the most high, your highest self, my baby. And that's why you're gay. You know what I'm saying? The person that keeps popping up in your readings, my baby, they're the other gay. You know what I'm saying? And they're stalking you. You know what I'm saying? But what they didn't know is that you're powerful. You're the magical magic shit. You know what I'm saying? The alchemist. Right, my baby? Because it's getting hot in here. You know what I'm saying? Humid. Humidity is going to play a hand in the next three days and nights. It's so prevalent. Anybody misusing their spiritual powers, especially as far as creativity, sexuality, the sacral chakra. Um, it's going to be a bad dude. Because I keep hearing somebody say, come on, sis, come on, bro. You know what I'm saying? Almost like the harvest, you know what I'm saying? The next three days and nights, so I just got to call it like I see it. Because it's tower, judgment, and death. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Ain't that all them Scorpio? Your energy is great. That They're not so much. You know what I'm saying? Because clearly your energy is good. You're in the, at least in the fifth dimension. Some people are being transmuted back into love. So let's get it, my baby. Excuse me, my baby. Let me uh, move this up. Yeah, if you got to say something, you're very powerful, my baby. Very powerful. Abundance is your birthright, my baby. Abundance is your birthright all day long. I scoot this closer. And you got family out here. Here go that tower again, 16. You got family out here. About to rescue you before the water start flowing. And you was promised a good life. I see the rainbow. I see you looking out. You got spiritual family looking out. And they're going to make sure it pop off to you. Anything that's not built on love, tower to that shit. All right, my baby. You know, sometimes you'd be feeling alone. Know that you're never alone, my baby. Ever, 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 ever. You're very wise. You know what time it is. You know what I'm saying? Once you go through an emotion, you don't have to feel that emotion anymore. Like, once you already experienced feeling alone, you don't have to keep revisiting that feeling, that sad, down and out. You know, because clearly that's not your energy. I, I tell my brothers and sisters all the time. If you wake up happy in the morning and feeling so light and beautiful and free, like you're feeling and walking on sunshine, right? How could you feel angry and, you know, irritated and yada, 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 and like not even an hour? You know what I'm saying? Clearly, it is not your energy, my baby. So you never feel alone, my baby, because for you, you are never alone. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But I see, like I said, you being rescued, right? Spirit came to you from feeling alone, from being trapped in your mind. Right, 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 right. Spirit got you from feeling trapped in your mind. Sorry, baby. That's other family members' uh, notes, you know what I'm saying? Their little messages. Ooh, sweet victory, my baby. I see you got the zest for life. Dig you here. Your blessings is about to pop off. Is somebody confused about how you making it pop off, my baby. You got the zest for life. You're really, literally a happy being. <laughs> literally a happy being. Compassionate. Wow. That's why you're about to get everything. 
Because you give everything. You give love to every being and thing. And that's why everything's going to be handed to you. <laughs> but remember I told you that Divine Sovereign. <laughs> Funny how Divine, uh, Divine Feminine has her hand on the world. <laughs> Isn't that extra? <laughs> right? But she's also killing the world, the beings and things on earth. She's healing, so she's healing. Beautiful. Sension. All that. Oh, my baby. Beautiful. All out of love. That's why you get everything. You get your flowers. No, my baby, I love it. This is beautiful. Mama Gaia here too. Divine Feminine here for all oh, my babies. Divine Feminine to the rescue, my baby. <laughs> Step into your role as a light worker. Whatever you're being called to do. Where you at, my baby? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Where you at? Where you at? Your family here for you. Stunned for you, my baby. Oh, you know what? Yeah, I'm just going to do that. Let's pull it out of order. I missed the card. Sorry, y'all. Uh. Oh, no, I didn't. Put this right in. Okay, I had it right. My best. I just want to be right and exact. You know what I'm saying? One thing you learn through this Jumanji, <laughs> right, was self-love is the best love in this realm, my baby. Keep hearing SWV rain. For sure. That's what I hear. Sorry, y'all. Put it down like this so I can get a better picture. I, I miss y'all. I had to holler at y'all first. It was something about this black rain, my baby. It's going to be significant in the next <laughs> three days and night. And this is the first day. Or it will be when you watch this video. You know what I'm saying, my baby? Real still. It's, it's something here for our family. So you love every being thing. I'm talking about nature love you for real, for real, my baby. This is ain't, I can make this shit up. Divine feminine out here all day. And that's why you got people puzzled. Because they, they like, man, this person, my family member, they make it pop all the time. How do they make it pop? You know what I'm saying? People try to have you feeling like. Man, but you got so much family out here. It's ridiculous, my baby. Ridiculous. Sweet oranges. You got your sexy bag. Definitely looking beautiful, succulent, very attractive at this time. A lot of people loving you. And somebody, they just amazed at your beauty, your tenacity, your zest for life. You know, somebody left you out in the cold, my baby. You, wow. You teaching people how to love. You know what I'm saying? You definitely on the top of the wheel. You definitely on social media. A lot of people are watching you. Yep, I see someone is trying to impede your progress. I call it the CB. Remember we was talking about CB? Because you the walkie-talkie, but you also got the CB. This is a CB. You know what I'm saying? A cock blocker, that's what I call it. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to block your path. Divine Feminine is on it. Right? Anyone that tries to feed off of you, 
You know what I'm saying? It's a no go. They play off of your um, emotions because you're, you know what I'm saying, compassionate. And they play off of that. Or try to, anyway. And I see you just generally love people. You know what I'm saying? Compassionate out here in this world. You know, it's hard being beautiful, but somebody got to do it, right, my baby? Wish fulfillment. That's why you're happy. Everything you ever dreamt of has manifest for you, right, my baby? You can see the evil plots and the shenanigans. You know, people scheming on you, try to have you trust all in your mind. But the, like I said, the fate they plan for you, they're experiencing. Right. Somebody is, they, they're up early in the morning, like around this time, 12 and 1, watching you on social media. You know what I'm saying? I don't even go off into it. This shit is crazy. You basically could tell and sense that, you know, somebody was trying to come up off of your name, status, finances, sex, or whatever, your currency. You know what I'm saying? Somebody that drags you down through there. You know what I'm saying? Somebody that drags you down through there. But I see you're very bright. Very bright, very beautiful, intellectual. You definitely getting higher learning. You're learning a lot about people that try to mistreat you and how you feeling trapped. You know what I'm saying? Especially when they know a lot of uh, our family members are like supposedly um, orphans. They're under the illusion of not having family, but in reality, they have more family than a little bit. <laughs> I'll put it to you like that. You got more family than a little bit out here. You should never, ever, ever feel alone, baby. For you are never alone. Clearly. You know what I'm saying? You, but you know now, this was in the past. This, that's how motherfuckers get over. They, they have you um, getting called up in your emotions. You know abundance is your birthright. Always have been, always will be. You know what I'm saying? The nine of cups are so anybody try to play you out or use and abuse you and dog you, it's gonna be a bad dude. bad dude, my baby. Yeah. Your highest self peep you to the play. I love Hermit car, self-reflection, doing them self-checks. Letting your highest self lead, the most high lead the way. Yes, take this. This is beautiful, Hermit baby. Higher nature revealing it all. Telling you to love yourself, concentrate on you. Right, my baby? And those that impede your way. Trying to have you all trapped in your mind. Nine of swords, all like that. Worrying and stressed out. <clears throat> Showing you what's going to happen to them. Learning you something, right, my baby? Learning us as a collective something. Yes. You ain't got to worry about nothing. You know your higher self is leading the way. Mama guy, I don't care what happened. For sure, my baby. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Page of Pentacles. This is a reader. No. I told you to stop letting people suck on you. You were told to stop letting people suck off your energy. About we know we learned about the oral pleasure yesterday, right, my baby? Right, you've been very loving out here in this world, very loving and compassionate. And a lot of our family feel like they got 
for lack of a better word, fucked every time. Every time they try to extend love, you know what I'm saying, and give compassion and be a genuine, true person. And here come, you know, I'll get disappointed. But guess what? Queen of Pentacles all day. That's your, that's your unknown. Right. <laughs> It's only one thing after the Queen of Pentacles, and we all know what that is. Empress, my baby. <laughs> Empress. Get it back. Let's get it in. That's what's, what's up with this evil plan. Scheme, scheme, plot, plot. Seven of Swords, sir. Yeah, my baby. This was crazy. On my bus, I didn't even tell you, because some people, they, you know, they sticklers. Um, really be, I'll be more oracle. But you got the wheel. <laughs> so this was an illusion spun up. You loving, you, you know, you're loving on another more than you love yourself. That was an illusion. That started this karmic cycle. And then, you know... Some of our family members gave this sea beer um, some of their sunshine, and it was healing them. So that's why they're, like, very, like, obsessive. They, like, I wish, I'm, I'm just going to say love to, you know, what, what they deem as love, but, you know what I'm saying? But they really loving having relations with you. You know, that's been a problem throughout your life. You know what I'm saying, my baby? Where, you know what I'm saying, you think you're happy, but then you see that, you know, you got a foo gazy, foo foo toy soldier in your midst that's just trying to come up off of you and run up, run off on the plug twice with your energy. So that turns you completely off, you know what I'm saying, and, you know, here we go again, yeah, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> forever getting, you know, your ex, stay getting these, you know what I'm saying, tens, sorry my family, stay getting these tens, you spun this up, my baby, <laughs> and you spun up your life, but you see the evil, I ain't gonna say evil, you see these little Illusionists, because they ain't no motherfucking magicians, man. Right. And like I said, 16 all days. Man. It's like the third 16 tower. Divine feminine, mama and clan. It's that. The law. But right about now, because remember I told you, the message was black rain to black rain. Divine feminine. So this is what's going on now. This wife for the next three days, three nights, you know, like I know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You need to get it together. You know what I'm saying? Right, right, right. And if, you know, if you're harnessing divine feminine or divine masculine energy without works done to glean them, that energy is going to be returned. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I hope you're not found one. Real spill. That shit is crazy. But not my family members, because I know you're going. Judgment. Remember I told you anything. Oh, I can't show you. Anything that's not Anything that's not of love. Got to give. Let's see, you pass judgment on this. You walked away. Eight cups. Yeah. Higher self told you to give set. Because you know why? Because it was revealed that you're strong. You're strong. You conquered your lower nature, your lustful side. Dig you, my baby. Woo, 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 woo. Yes. You definitely harnessing your man number one. This sun and the moon. That's like the first. Right. So definitely balance your divine masculine and divine feminine. And to me, the sun and moon are like the most high's eyes, right? <laughs> Real spell. So it just looks like 
you're walking the middle paths, wielding uh, your powers beautifully. Fair and just, like law and orders, is beautiful. Walking in your power. Definitely in the fifth dimension, huh, my baby? Chilling in those waters. Definitely, definitely change your lower nature. This strength card is beautiful. Definitely. You got somebody confused. They're trying to figure out why you ain't weak in the knees. Oh, no, my baby. Why you ain't go for the okie doke? Because you've seen your ascension right here. You've seen that you're Queen of Pentacles, but we know that Emperor is about to pop out. You a hangman right now. Thinking about everybody that you had to let go, everybody that dogged you, and everything you had to do to get where you are, Nine of Pentacles. Because you high priestess got that wisdom. Ooh. Yes, justice on here. You the one causing these towers, my baby. As you should, my baby. If it's not of love and light, it gots to go. Sorry, my baby. I'm just getting these car horses. You know, we got a lot, and they, some of them in between other decks. Okay. Yes, my baby. This your unknown. You're going into. You're going to be. Or you are seeing when people try to have you all worried. They try to have you all worried in your mind. Let's see, you're smart. You got a military mindset, my babies. For sure. Mm mm mm. Dig you. Military mindset. You an artist. You do whatever you do, you do it out of love. Like I said you generate love. And I see this, you know, you didn't have to walk away. Or you got hold in one relationship you got and just in life in general, how about that? You got broken hearted eight times. You saw that eight people that you know betrayed you, and you had to walk away. Whether it was chick, child, dog, or man. But I see you strong. People just not, they're ill-equipped to handle you. And you know that. You know what I'm saying? Right. You know about divine unions. You know about marital sex. Mm -hmm. Definitely being guided at this time. <laughs> Off rip is the lovers. You a child of the most high. Somebody tried to juggle you with a Reggie, Reggie Miller. <laughs> wow. And this person, they didn't know that you was their divine counterpart. Yeah, I see you told them about their stuff in the past before it happened. Yeah, this person needs to give you um, massages to loosen you up, to get on, to get some of your passion. Right. <laughs> uh, I don't even want to. 
it's like this. Sometimes it be like the same old stories, you know, family. <laughs> it don't even be worth even repeating. But yeah, you on your way. It's about to be on and popping. Three days, three nights. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. Badass being car. Hmm. You're walking. you walking right into your destiny in the next three days and three nights. Black rain and black rain. Yeah. That's too many cards. Come on, man. That's good. Did you tell me about this card? Like somebody tried to block your your destiny. How the, where are you bad at? You they can only stop there. Is it? You know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah, this person keeps thinking about. <laughs> yeah, stop it. This person is projecting past memories of you two together over and over and over and over and over again. That's why this person kept popping up in your mind. Right? So you kept, man, you kept, I'm about to show you, man, this motherfucker's out here just dealing with some other shit. Have you ever wondered why all of a sudden, out of the blue, you kept thinking about this person? You kept reflecting over and over and over and over again. They were projecting that. They were projecting that. This past memory onto you. Keep you trapped in your fucking mind. That was the evil plan. But guess what? The universe got tired of that shit. The universe got tired of that. That's what they were doing. That's that. Whack-ass sex illusionist. Not even deserving to be a magician. And the divine is here for that. Tower to that. <laughs> yeah. Judgment. A lot of, a lot of people are going to learn what love at first sight is. Love at first sight. You're going to know love the first time you see it. That's all I got to say about that. Judgment. And here you go to Herman. Because like I said, they're meditating. They're sitting there. Number one, they already know that you're with another. Because I, I don't know for sure. You're a uh, child of the most High, But it looks like you're with another person. So this person is on the outside doing candle work. They didn't fell off like a bad blow pack. They're impoverished. And they see you living your life. And they see you happy and in love with a divine counterpart. You know what I'm saying? They keep burning these candles, these red and orange candles to get you, keep you trapped. And to keep you, and for you to be stuck on a cycle where you keep meeting people that desire to come up off of you. They don't want to ever do the work. They just want to mooch off of you in any way they can. So this person spent this up, this illusion is, you know what I'm saying? But guess what? Now they're trapped in their mind. You know, this is like one of the first cards. They're trapped in their mind. Because they can't believe you figured it out. But we're, we're, we're going. I'm almost finished. I'm going to stop this. Yes, I see you sitting pretty, huh, my baby? Sitting pretty. Yeah. I see you didn't buy a whole, a whole bunch of sweaters. A lot of family members have bought a whole bunch of coats and robes and cloaks. Man, it's like, that is too many cars. It's like 20 cars. Sorry, Tim. But, um, yeah. The device and all this shit. Because remember, the moon and the strength card, the most high is watching all this shit. The most high, the divine realm, your cosmic and galactic family has seen you take an L's, at least eight L's, emotionally. You know what I'm saying? For real, for real. And then you're tired of you getting dragged, like, tricking no good. So tire down to all that shit, but for sure, tire down to this magician. We're going to get clarity about this magician. 
because the trolls and the trolls, aka, you know, because trolls is female trolls, aka trollops. The trolls and the trollops, the trolls and the trolls are on the trail, but they about to be on trial. Yeah, the trolls and the trolls who are out here on the trawl or the troll whole straw and misusing their sexuality, the bind right here for you, my baby. Bind is here for us. So that's people to judge me. Yes. Nine of swords. Woo, 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 woo. I said this word. This is the second nine of swords. Second nine of swords, man. Stop it. 99. Second nine of swords. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Crazy. Yeah. Constantly have you like in limbo. This person constantly has you in limbo. But I see here you go that temperance card. Because remember I told you we could stay getting the temperance card, my baby. Stay getting it. Balance. You know what I'm saying? You ain't spaz out. None of that shit. You just. It is what it is. You know what I'm saying? And here go this fucked up ass illusionist. Because you know this is the second magician card. Right my baby. Where that first little fucker at? The illusionist. Because remember they ain't no motherfucking magician. Because they have to use dark magic. Black magic. Right? But look at this white one. Don't he look crazy? This 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 the motherfucker in your life. Whether they're basking in the feminine, I guarantee they look like this. Promise you. Where my baby? And they mad AF. They really want to cut you. <laughs> it look like they want to cut you too. Like how the fuck? They strong. They mad as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Nah, what well, it can't do shit. That's the only reason I laugh. I'm not laughing like the shit funny because it's not as sad. But just like the visuals just do sometimes shit for me out. But now this motherfucker want to send a love poem. You know, because they know that you're happy. But here they come. You know what I'm saying? Still burning these candles. Burning them in the moonlight. This is definitely an illusion. They don't know what the hell they're doing. They don't know if they're coming or going. Right, my baby? Yeah. This is it. Three days and nights, you're going to see some pop off, my baby. Let me see where we at. Okay, we ain't bad. Sometimes the messages be long. Sometimes they be short. Either way, they going to get out. Right, my family? Because we keeping it real. <laughs> That's what we doing. being revealed about this magician. They they trying to send you messages, but the divine realm is blocking all of that. Yeah. Four cups. Yeah. They had a habit of, you know, being very, this person was very promiscuous. They used we as a lure to get a family member high, or some family member. And I just see, you know, them outside. Something about the Rainbow Bridge. And this person basically tried to, you know, dog our family member. And they were already, you know, bending over backwards. This person tried to dog our family member. And then tried to block their destiny. Those days are over. And just with that, you broke off the relationship. And this person has a habit of Hitting it and quitting it. They don't kiss and tell. They hit and run. Right, my baby? That's this person who I'm talking about. Along with the seven other people who tried to come up off of you. That's terrible. 
Yeah, Hierophant again. Definitely got the keys. Your higher self is definitely telling you what's popping. Definitely letting you know. You know what I'm saying? To sit on your yum yum. And your higher self is definitely telling you, fuck the past. We worried about the future. What's popping? Are you ready or not? That's what your higher self is telling you. Are you ready or not? You ready to be the queen of pentacles? Or you still in, um, want to be stuck in the same rut? Somebody is driving past your house, I promise you. And it really looks like two people, and then both of them have big trucks with rims. I kid you not. One follows you while you do your errands throughout the day, you shop. And then you have another one that watches you at night. It really looks like somebody trying to come in through your bedroom window. When they, no, this person is tick, tick, boom. They look like they're not wrapped too tight. They're touched and not by an angel. And it really does look like they will actually climb up to your bedroom window. But now they're just thinking about you every time they look to your window, every time they drive past. But you're on your way to full card. You see that? And you know you have to remove people that, you know, that worried you, make you feel less than the beautiful being you are. Let me give you a few fortune cards. I didn't mean to be so winded, but that was like all your messages. It's the unknown, but it's known now. <laughs> That's what you're about to tap into in the next three days and nights. The unknown. Why my baby? Ooh, divine feminine, extra joker. You got a joker up your sleeve. Divine Feminine got you. It's coming to the rescue. Yes. And you discovered a mystery today, my baby. Yes, definitely discovered a mystery. Affecting you. Definitely discovered the, a mystery about this person, this sex illusionist, because they're not a sex magician. How they had a spell book and was casting spells on you. But just remember, it's your, your name is written in the Lamb's Book of Life, my baby. They're uh, sorry now. Sorry that they play off of you. You know, strictly because they know you like to make love, but only to one person at a time because you're a divine royal. But they played off of that. They just told you whatever so they can get some yum yum. I keep stressing it, and that's why they're stuck in their mind. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Orange and compassion. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. The birds told you about fierce enemies around you and people trying to cast misfortune on you. But every time spirit help you avert, 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 and abort any negative being or thing, you always get the heads up because you tapped in, been tapped in. You always been tapped in. 
Ooh, that's a lot of cards, but it was only one that turned over, and it's the ro Rose card. <laughs> and you already know what family you from. Family of love, Mother Gaia. <laughs> right, 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 right. Yes, divine feminine. And health is being released in your life. Yes, no more... No more um, clouds, no more thorns, my baby. Dude, you. That's what's up. Your cosmic and galactic family told you who was sending worry and torment demons. That's what they were doing. That's what the candles was for. Duh. They were sending torment demons to you. But all you do is send love out to everyone. That's why their magic didn't work. They're sending hate, 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 hate. And you're sending love out. Right. That's why you're on top of the wheel. Wow. That's why you guys, you know what I'm saying? Emotional health. Success in all your adventures. And just know if you're going through any negativity that it was soon something will be around to dispatch of it sooner than you think you will be happy and prosperous divine marriage i see you married to self yes my baby this was beautiful black let me see black rain but first tower to all that shit that's your title. That's what I heard. Black rain, but first, tower to all that shit. Right, my baby. Hungry, not thirsty. Be open to assistance from your cosmic and galactic family, the most high. Your new nickname is Walkie Talkie, because you walk it like you talk it. And remember, fuck those that talk about you, right? Because they don't follow through and do all the beautiful things that you do. <laughs> and on that note, love and light. This is Capricorn's Unknown. You're very powerful. It's going to be human. Something about, yeah, from deja vu to popo vu. And 180 degrees west. How about that? London, England. Greenwich time, prime time, prime meridian. Bye, my family. I love you with my highest love. Remember, you're straight because you got a joker up your sleeve. Divine feminine is here. Bye, my baby.